Hello everyone, my name is Evil Spirit, and welcome back to more Final Fantasy VII Remake. Last time. Uh, we are going to go find... Tifa. Huh. Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Hell it is. Goddamn eco warriors with their dumbass posters. I tear them down and they're back up inside of an hour. Like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steelwork. You trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> <laughs> what the? You okay, buddy? <laughs> Mako junkie, huh? Figures. You yeah. Again. Well, tell the, the freaking hour can't come soon enough. Oh, I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. When I get back, it's refueling time. And you, Jesse? I don't know. Figure out how I screwed up. Huh. You're such a kidder. Don't let them bleed the planet dry. Avalanche. That used to be my PlayStation 4 background. That was the song that I always played. Seventh Heaven. Cloud. I mean, Cloud. Tifa. Mm, Arlene. <laughs> Daddy, you're home. That's right, Angel. I Welcome am. Back. <laughs> Have you been a good girl? <laughs> did that guy just run the floor? Oh, you Tifa. did, did you? Well, well. <laughs> you made it. Where'd you get that? I can't remember the last time I saw a real one. Huh? How sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? A guy can change. It has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. You wanna ask for your Daddy, money? The Mako place blew up. Everyone on TV's talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. <laughs> now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? Do you mind keeping Marlene company until I'm done with this? Me? Yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, your money. Ask Tifa. She takes care of it. Uh <gasps> What the hell do you think you're doing scaring my daughter like that? I mean, Daddy says never talk to strangers. <clears throat> That's right, honey. I do say that. What a good girl you are remembering Daddy's lessons. <laughs> but see, like in the original you know Final Fantasy VII, you've barely do? seen Marlene. They go to bed on time. Come on. But I'm not tired. I want to talk some more, Daddy. All right, but just this once. Uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still waiting on it. Uh, right. About that. We should talk outside. Uh-oh. Um, Daddy? Did the people who died all return to the planet? Of course. Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me then. How was it up on the plate? 
It was chaotic. Sorry for dragging you into all this. It was wrong of her to put you in danger like that. I promise I won't do it again. Dangerous part of the job. Don't worry about me. I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shimmer. Not good at all. What it is, but my life feels so So you make nice with everyone? As much as I could, all things considered. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. I'll spread whatever you know, lies Shinra tells me to. So, it wasn't that bad? It was. Oh, right. And here we are. Good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with Seventh Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Oh, it's this room. Here's your room, 202. Thank you. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean, I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No. It's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. Hmm, okay. It's a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always there get it. There is one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2000 remember? I do. And we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry. Uh -huh. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. And you're sure about that? Of course, as long as you help, that is. Wait, then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No, two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, at least fifteen hundred. You're the best. No. I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. I forgot that this was all just a gig for Cloud. It wasn't... You would think it would be something bigger, but... No, it never really was supposed to be. It was all supposed to be... I actually wanted to talk about... Oh, never mind, because there's a cutscene here. I'll talk about it during combat or something. Guess it's time for introductions. Oh, no. Hey, you okay in there? Oh. Coming in. Sorrow. Oh, is that the next final? Is it Final Fantasy VII reunion? What are you doing to Marco? This is his apartment. He's got a few problems, but he's not a bad guy. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? 
sure. Hmm. Uh, saying, I don't think that's a good thing to sleep on, your freaking one plate of armor. And a bunch of, like a washer, big washers on your arm. I was like, I know what you're gonna do. Well, now, you must be Cloud. Yes. I'm Marl, your landlady. So, how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you mine. It can be about anything, even Tifa. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had, and if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you, and then some. Mm hmm. Nothing to report. Containing my husband decided to go. Just imagine if rich people this Heard about you and me gonna win the play steps the floor. Pen the tail on the chocobo. Wait. You were right, boss. It was those avalanche terrorists that bombed the reactor. We won't let them beat us. Not ever. Right. Once the trains are running, we'll head to the office and do whatever we can to help. That's how we can fight back against terrorism. But yeah, I was thinking about, uh, crap. Yeah, like the original seven, I forgot, like, Cloud didn't do this out of the kindness of his heart. He was getting paid for it. And I don't think Cloud ever gets his money. Because he does, like, another mission with Jesse and Biggs and Wedge. And then there's another mission. And that mission is, uh, pretty big. Looks like a real hard ass, but actually pretty chill. Huh. Talking about Barrett. Morning. Hey. Just so you know, Marlene's still asleep. <sighs> Let's get down to business, shall we? To defeat the Hans? These water filters won't replace themselves. Although the next batch probably could, if Jesse put her mind to it. Most every home in the area has one. Folks love them because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell. Honestly, they make us more money than this place. And it's easy money, too. We bring new filters, <laughs> collect the old ones, and get paid. What? <sighs> Give me a break. I'm not a salesman. I'm a soldier. Which is why no one will refuse to pay. What do you oh. say? Please? Oh, her eyes. <sighs> Let's get this over with. Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour. All right. Uh, hold on. What's that one game called in uh, Final Fantasy 15? Let me grab my book out here.
Nope, it's not Justice Monster 5. Sorry about that, people. <laughs> Go away. Go. So bright. Go ahead and keep whatever we collect. Seeing as you didn't bring any luggage, I'm guessing there's stuff you need to buy. Thanks. And don't worry. We'll pay you the difference after. Barrett's out making his rounds too. Don't take your eyes off your tools. Take your time now, okay? Something creepy to you. You could walk straight from the blade. No matter your needs or your Hey there. Here to change out your water filter. Tifa, baby, how you doing? I've been waiting for you too. Cloud's in charge of collections. Help you. Sounds like a pretty sweet gig. If you ever need someone to fill in, I'm your man. In your dreams, maybe. Huh? Cloud! Uh, since we're here? Maybe we should do a little shopping. Suppose I could take a look. As you can tell. All the items you can walk straight from the plate. He's a regular. Stock up here and he might throw in a freebie or two. For you, maybe. Well, you could try being a little nicer. To get free shit? Not my style. <laughs> Our next stop is Stargazer Heights. Landlady's a client. Just met her. Then you know what to expect. Remember. She's a good friend of Avalanche. Something can't help but take a little pleasure in their panic. More than a little. Apparently, it was done by a terrorist group called Avalanche. Nothing to report. Maintaining surveillance. Oh, being a spy is so cool. Holding position until nightfall. We'll report any developments immediately. Hey, Marl. Got some filters for you. Tifa, my dear, dear girl. Oh, what's he doing here? Working? Be nice. <laughs> Cloud's helping me with collections. You better take care of her. I'm pretty good at taking care of myself, you know. That I do. Still, better him than you. No charm, no wit, big sword, but no skills. Mm. I've got skills. Be nice. I'm doing my best. You're looking awfully glum. Are you getting enough sleep? A good long rest to cure anything, I tell you. A tried and true lesson for life on the ground floor, am I right? That you are. Now, your money. Do you want to give? You take care of yourself. Don't Sweet. do anything 1, I wouldn't do. Yeah, you can go to rest spots. Basically, if you sleep in any other JRPG, then you know what to expect. Here, Carol's great. She helped get me set up back in the day. Mm. In here oh, saying, Five years, give or take. But never mind that. Absolutely. We've got to get you your money. Last stop is the weapons store. That's only six. That's only six hundred. Hey, if it isn't Tifa, you here for the filter? Yep. And I think this one's on the house too. Hey, that last filter didn't do shit. We're so sorry about that. Hopefully this one will work better. Save your excuses and get out! All right. If you could just settle your bill, we'll be on our way. The hell? You charging me for your busted ass goods? My associate handles payment disputes. Think you can mosey up in here and have it your way? Pretty please. <laughs> Thank you very much. Yeah. Seeing as right. we're done with our rounds and you've got a small fortune now, why not take a gander at the weapons? Well, when will Barrett be back with the rest? 
Before we open up tonight. It'll be a while yet, so... What do you want to do? Don't really know. In that case, I've got a suggestion. Want to hear it? If you're serious about becoming a merc, then you're going to need to start making connections. It's not what you know, but who you know, you know? Hmm. Yep. Connections get you jobs. Jobs build your rep. And more rep gets you better connections. How do I start? Hmm. Why not help out the neighborhood watch? They're mostly volunteers, but you'll get to know people. Yeah, okay. Didn't see anybody at the office, so let's head up top. <laughs> There's any way they can make our guns. Huh? I ain't got nothing for a punk ass bitch like you. Get on out of here. No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. But yeah, that guy seems really willing to give me let me buy some from him. We gotta do something about the monsters on the boulevard. I'll head on down there first. Pigs? Wedge, what are you What are you guys huh? doing? Didn't know you were holding down the fort. Huh? Oh hey Cloud. Looking to join the neighborhood watch? That depends. What does this neighborhood watch do? Uh, lots of stuff, really. But our top priority is taking care of any beasts that wander into town. That, and teaching the locals how to defend themselves. Like they say, the only one who will look out for you is you. Cloud's a great fighter, but only we know that. If no one knows him, no one will hire him. Thought if he joined the watch, he could get his name out there. That would work for everybody. Truth be told, we could really use your help. We can't pay you in gill, but we'll work something out. For example... Aha! Uh -huh. What about your sword? I could mod it for you. No thanks. It's fine just the way it is. What? You some kind of purist? I know I'd never pass up a chance to improve my gear. Come on. At least let me show you how it's done. <laughs> the Buster Sword. Uh, yeah, skill points. Yeah, go here. Oof. So much better than 13. All set. Needless to say, you'll have to try it out to appreciate the difference. Thanks. <laughs> we'll do you one better. Spread the word to everyone who'll listen about the new Merc in town. Between him and Wedge, there isn't anyone they don't know. I'll march through the streets singing your praises, even on an empty stomach. Damn. So, where are these monsters? Scrap Boulevard. Sh Shut up, honey. Hey, Cloud, I'll come with. No, I've got this. But... You don't know the way, do you? We are. Hmm. <laughs> sure thing. I know these streets better than anyone. Yin Yang's watching me. Uh, watching. Um, uh, <laughs> I have Nintendo Capri Suns playing for the zombie video going on. Scrap Yin Yang would definitely get people left. The barricade's supposed to keep the monsters out. Anyway, we should prepare just in case. No better way to keep you and your family safe. Huh? I ain't got Come nothing for a punk ass bitch like you. Speak with our friendly staff. They'll find somewhere else to hang out. Searching for candidates. We're doing our best to keep them hidden. Increasing patrols. He's how you can get stuff like Sheva. All your. Uh, Daily dose of. Good luck, Tifa, and be careful. Here's Scrap Boulevard. I can see why monsters would feel right at home. And the more we pile up, the more they show up. Ice material. Oh.
Just a warm up. I'll bet. Let's keep at it. Enough. Hold on. Stay gone for long. Of course not. Even so, folks will be grateful for the peace and quiet in the meantime. A win's a win, you know? True. Trust me, it'll do wonders for your rest. Like right. Let's go check in with Biggs and Wedge. Go get some cake, bitches. Go get some cake, bitches. It's funny because I do have Final Fantasy 15, and I would love to do a playthrough of that game. And you know, that might be a playthrough, like a breather playthrough during uh, this and Rebirth. I don't know. I don't know when Rebirth comes out to where... I think Rebirth comes out early, like winter for this year. So. Hey, I am a Merc bro. Searching for candidates. Searching for candidates. I'll come back here. Got new numbers for Monster Slain this month. Check them out. Huh? I ain't got nothing for a punk ass. But a way to keep you and your family safe. You hear someone got rid of one. Back already? Got every last one too. Now the slum should be safe. You guys are machines. Good job. Meanwhile, we told everyone we could about you. So I heard. I've got to ask, though. What did you tell them? It's all right. All you got to do is keep up the good work. It'll pay off soon enough, I promise. How's the sword, by the way? Good. Glad to hear it. Seems like the perfect fit for you. Yeah. We've been through a lot. <laughs> Oh. You okay? I'm not going to give the spoiler of where that sword came from. Fine. But been meaning to ask after you left the village. It's a long story. I've got time. Why don't you tell me all about it while we try to wrestle up some more work for you? That sounds great! I'll come too! Oh, uh, no, you won't. What? How long now, you two? Uh, sorry, Go on. maybe not. <laughs> huh? No or fair! Uh, think about it for a second. They haven't seen each other in years. You'd be a third wheel. Yeah. 
That's... Yeah. Hey, before we get back to it, why don't you check out the weapons? No need. Come on, the dealer's probably heard all about you by now. Might treat you better. I don't know about that. You hear someone got rid of all the monsters on the trap No better way to keep you and your family safe? Ooh! Hold on. Heard there's a merc that'll take on any monster. You the man? Word spreads fast around here. What if I am? Sorry about before. I get antsy when business is slow. <sighs> man in your line of work needs weapons, no? Why not try that one on for size? How much? Yours on the house. Oh, that dude. Is like shit. you rocking my weapons is good advertising. Think about it. Fine. Win win. Or if you want to take a look at something else. Just a look. Oh, I can't sell though. Wait, no, I can't. Uh, huh. I had I had something that nobody's. A stranger. Oh yeah, that's... Since you've got yourself a new weapon, let's see if we can't put it to good use. Come on, let's go chat up Weimer. Who? The guy who tracks all the requests that come to the watch. You never know. Where is he at? Oh, he should be back at the office by now. Now Tifa can have this. <laughs> she can't have anything. Oh, well, it was worth the trade. Hey, you just opened up shop in the area. Was Weimer the uh, kid who was talking, or is that one? Hey, you just opened up shop in the area. Oh, hey there, Tifa. You need a helping hand? Actually, I wanted to introduce you to an old friend of mine. This is Cloud. He's a merc. Ah, uh, you don't say. Well, we're always on the lookout for experienced fighters to help us deal with the bigger critters. I'll take on anything. For the right price, that is. Experienced and cocky, huh? If it's a challenge you want, I might have a few good ones. Your clients can fill you in on the details. Prove yourself with these jobs, and I'll see if I can't find you some things. Candidate detected. Performing physical analysis. Sizable weapon. An optimal candidate. My name is Chadley. I'm an Chad. in research and development division. I hope you'll be interested in helping me with my research. Please accept this as a down payment. I would like you to set that assessed materia in you. This data will help me to develop new types. I'm not interested in work. You should know that I work actively to undermine Shinra's efforts. I'm sure you of all people can appreciate the tremendous power of materia, and if you later decide that I am not worthy of your trust, you can do what you do best. I will hold you to that. Excellent! Then we shall work together so long as you deem fit. Once you've completed your task, please return and... Yeah. Chadley... Please set the orb of assessed materia to your... Chadley is a pretty useful person if you love materia, because... He also gives you uh, summoning material, which is really good. Um. You'll never want for work around here if you prove yourself useful. Okay. You're our go-to monster <sighs> saying now. I can finally sleep at night. I hear you so sore. Hmm. Hey, you just opened up shop in the area, didn't you? Maybe I might end this episode here. Yeah, we're at 35 minutes. 
I think it'd be better if we wait till next time. Anyways, thank you all for watching. This has been Final Fantasy VII Remix. See you guys next time. Bye!